What's up guys, my name is Section from the Deviants, and today we're going to be reacting to Oran High School Host Club Season 1, Episode 7. In the last episode, we had a middle school kid go out to talk to me and say like, hey, can I learn from you and how to make women happy? Now, Takami said yes, but it ended up being a disaster because he was basically like Hiro in a sense of where he's very blunt. But anyways, we find out that the high or the middle school kid is basically doing this so that he can impress this girl who's going to mo be moving away to Germany. So instead of teaching him how to flirt with girls and stuff like that, Takami basically taught him how to play this piece on the piano so that he could play with her and everything ended up okay. Kind of. So without further ado, let's get straight on into it. Make sure for the original content as always. All right, let's get going in three, two, one, and go. Wait a minute. This is indoors. I can see the squares. Wait, what? Japan, right? Behold, how, how much money do they have? Bask in the beauty I know they're rich, but still. Birds. Aren't they breathtaking? Try to make the most of this downtime and just relax. We're so worried about keeping our good looks day and night. We deserve a little vacation. Senpai, where are we anyway? A little early. Ah! Target capture. Wait, what the? Some in. Good work. Now take her with you. Roger. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we going? <laughs> this place is a brand new theme park that my family, the Otori Group, runs. Of course. Of course they run it. I don't understand. I thought the Otori Group ran hospitals and that they're focused on the medical business. Yes, this is mental. Mentality. This place could be classified as a healing facility. Yeah. Hmm. It's therapeutic. A Think water park. People who are overworked that would just love a vacation in the South Tropics. Those people can now seek refuge here at this theme park and reduce their stress levels. Pretty nice. The Otori Group's primary concern has always been for the good health and well-being of the general public. It sounds suspicious to me. Howdy, John! Want to share some coconut juice with me? Or do you want to try a piece of the mango cake? Yeah, sure. I'll have some coconut juice with you. <laughs> or what about cake? Oh, I love those sounds of the birds. Haruhi, you want to go check out the water slide? Hang on, what's the deal with that pullover you're wearing? Oh, this thing? <laughs> <laughs> Here, do what you've got to do. Okay, we'll do what we can. Some alien tent. Cute. What even is that? That's nothing more than a couple of strings. <laughs> Perfect. Hmm. <laughs> the chills. Senpai? <laughs> Just hurry up and put it on. He told her to wear it? A Surprising. A young woman should not show that much skin until after she's married. I'm not that big on water parks. We're just gonna spend all day goofing off. Honestly, I'd rather Icy be bones, at home. Harry. I don't Harry understand Harry what's so great about this place anyway. I mean, what? all you what really do you mean? need to play in the water is a plastic pool. A plastic but pool? But it's the what's atmosphere. That? Why did you make Haruhi put on that yellow monstrosity? I, I would have thought for sure that you'd be all... I want to see Haruhi in a swimsuit! <laughs> he probably was, until he actually saw it. was surprising. That's not it at all! I was just trying to protect her innocence no, that's as not. father or guardian would! I love how he always, like, goes to the father role. <laughs> gonna swim today hold on you know how to swim do you still need that float <laughs> just looks cuter this way you know he's so innocent no way you got it all wrong no there's no way you have it in here he, oh yeah sorry what <laughs> she have tattoo how does she do that it's like the rig follows us what's with the tattoo on your stomach Oh, that? You don't recognize it? I'm cosplaying. Yeah, as who? I am Quan Kisaragi! I wouldn't have guessed. Uh, you know what? You attempted. Good for you. Hey boss, are you sure it's okay for Renge to be dressed like that? Well, yeah. 
That's okay. He's found with Renge. And why is that? Because it's cosplay? Think about what he said to you earlier. <laughs> Just looks cuter this way, you know? Try putting uh -oh. the word I at the beginning of that sentence. Hmm. I look cute. He planned that? Of course. That's Honey Nozuka for you. In the last episode, he felt threatened by another Last episode. Boy type, so he's taken steps to keep his rank. I should give him more credit. And she's dick. Could he really be that smart? Oh yeah, he's trying super hard. I gotcha. Come on, boss, let's go. Forget it. Why would I want to subject myself to a childish game like that? <laughs> Haruhi, I think it's time that we got married. Then we'll honeymoon in Otomi. <laughs> Always using Haru. Do you really think I'd ever let Haruhi marry you guys? <laughs> Taking a break, huh? You want something to drink? Yeah, thanks. Sideways sleeping shot! Ah! That's cheating! <laughs> Not the banana peel again. <laughs> Is a spooky island? Oh, you sent something? <laughs> Gosh dang it. The twins need to pick up their peels. Gentlemen, we're going after Honey Senpai! That pool looks like the quickest way! Charge! <laughs> Wait, I wouldn't go. <laughs> Why are there alligators in there? That didn't seem safe to me. What's with all the alligators? Beats me. I guess it is kind of dangerous to let them run wild. Though, yeah. the cause of our present situation seems to be the location of the switch for the current pool. I'll have to have a little chat with our designers. Thanks a lot, you guys. Wow, this place is just like a real jungle, huh? Yeah, and I keep hearing all of these really strange animal calls. Mori Senpai is always so straight-faced. I can never tell what he's thinking. But Probably he freaking he's out. A good job of staying calm. I'm sure he's worried. <laughs> uh -huh. tell me there's another plant. Goodness gracious. Uh-oh. It's about time for the squall. Huh? The squall? Hey, Mori Senpai. You seem to be really close with Honey Senpai. Are the two of you like childhood friends? You mean you don't know that they're cousins? Oh, okay. The Mori Nozukas have been serving the Honey Nozuka family for generations. So it's like Naruto. Mori Senpai has always made a point to accompany Honey Senpai. Must really get his blood going. I'm not sure I understand all this blood and loyalty business. But it's obvious that Mori Senpai thinks an awful lot of Honey Senpai. Mm -hmm. Hey Mori Senpai, it's gonna be alright. I'm sure that Honey Senpai is safe. He's so tall. He's tougher than you might think he is. You're right. Senpai's out for my spot is how do he's daddy? <laughs> Nobody wants that spot but you, boss. Mori Senpai, you're going the wrong way. Honey Senpai was headed in the opposite direction. You're wrong. He went this way. That's the first time he's ever called me by my name. So effortlessly. A little bit pleased. Yes. My family's private police force is going to send in a search and rescue team to help police force. They're better equipped to find Honey Senpai than we are. Hey, where are Mori and Haruhi? <laughs> They're lost. Oh, gosh. Don't pick up the guns. Oh, my gosh. Oh the gosh. Captured by a suspicious man. We'll take the target they got it custody. all wrong. You know, I don't believe I mentioned to them that there are other visitors here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, uh, uh, oh is he gonna fight the police? Oh my gosh. Is he gonna be like Yoda? What? You guys should be more careful who you mess with. Picking on my friends is bad. Got it? 
I'm so confused. They they need to hire a better police force. Are you all right? Hey, it's Tommy Chan. Oh wow, you okay, Senpai? Buddy! Oh, worried about so her. So worried. So then you don't know about Senpai? We, 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 no. Nozukas are famous for their martial arts. Ah. Not only have they helped train the police and SDF forces, but they've also worked with several overseas militaries. This man is just holding back 24-7 then. Mori Senpai is no slouch either. He won the national championship in Kendo when he was just in middle school. I am a second generation <laughs> student of the Ishizuka Dojo. Oh, gosh. I'm a student gosh. of the Tomoki Dojo. And I'm from the Otake Dojo. We are in your debt. We're so sorry, sir. We were unaware that we were searching for Mitsukuni Haninozuka. We've committed a terrible offense here. I apologize for this confrontation. You did an amazing job of protecting Haru-chan. <laughs> I bet you were pretty lonely without me around, huh? Heck yeah. I don't know if I'd say that. You know, maybe we should go to the beach next. Yeah, the beach would be nice. Yeah, I think this, this is the best. How he's not interested in anything like that? Actually, I might like to go to the beach. Mm -hmm. Really? And it's so pretty. Yeah. All right. Then that's <laughs> where we'll go next time. In the next episode. Ah. I run around a thousand miles and I am barely breathing. So I am convinced that Kiyoya's family just owns everything. Like I understand everyone, but Haru is extremely rich and that's why they go to this school. But Kiyoya is the only person that we've seen actually like we've actually seen his wealth like this water park it is is, is a big deal like not only is it massive when we looked at the map but like it has live animals and i and i find it i find it funny that it was talking to me that was the one who requested her to wear like the sweater and shorts like i was going to agree with the twins in which like the twins were thinking that talking to me was going to be like hey i want to see haru in a swimsuit and all that stuff and to be honest maybe he thought that in the first place but then as soon as he saw her he's like no no too much too much cover yourself up talking about another person that we've seen the wealth uh ringe she not only does she hire a whole hollywood staff but she's somehow able to hire these engineers that can make a lift to come out of anywhere so while she was explaining the whole honey senpai trying to act super cute thing we also got a little thing with Takami because the twins basically pointed out like hey she's wearing something a lot more revealing than Hori was and Takami wasn't phased at all and he played it off to the fact that like oh she she's cosplaying but then we can clearly see his bias towards Haru now while they were playing water guns uh he or Takami hit the it was just like a totem pole but basically it was a switch that controlled the current of the lazy stream, thus sending uh, Honey Chan, Hardy Chan, Honey Senpai, whatever, through the current, getting lost. Now everyone's searching for him. Now they're trying to help him, but then they got caught with like al real life alligators. And then we found out about the fine print, which basically Kiyoya let them hang out here just to be guinea pigs, to, just to try everything out, make sure it's working so that next month it can actually open. And through searching for Honey, we get this backstory which is basically they are cousins they are related but it's always uh the dude's family that is protectors or they they serve the honey people kind of like hinata and naruto so to better find him I, and they they have combat knives they have automatic guns like they're just trying to like find someone and thus we get the standoff which Honey just comes in and starts sumoplexing them. And then we find out that he is a master in karate and some other form. And that his family are the ones that teach police officers and secret service and stuff like that how to do this stuff. And in the end, we get a kind of foreshadowing for next episode, which is basically they're going to be going to the beach. But anyways, that was my reaction to Oron High School Host Club Season 1, Episode 7. If you like my reaction, make sure to like and subscribe. If you guys don't want to know anything more, put a comment section down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.